Due to the enthusiastic use of flavoring words, viewer discretion is advised. Yeah, there's a sleeping. Yeah, there's a sleeping. Yeah, yeah, there's a sleeping. And I forgot to grab the theme song file for the miniverse. So I gotta make my own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right before you start or like, making a video or recording, you're always like, mm, yeah, yeah talk. Because mm. for some reason, it's like something happens in my body where when, when you get when nervous, I, when I know, mm. when I know something's coming. Yeah, well, according to the general public, I'm very nervous on camera. <clears throat> um, yeah, <laughs> that's what it was. Until you guys start fighting together. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and, people are and just then like, I'm too crazy. Did you see people's comments on that? <laughs> Yeah, oh, man. That was fun. That was that was the first was great. debate. Was but good. yeah, whenever I'm doing something, <clears throat> this time, though, my voice disappeared for one second. I couldn't even talk just now. I don't even know where it went. I have no clue where where it went. Your ah. lips were just moving, but nothing was coming out. Yeah, nothing was coming out. It was like I was lip syncing. Nothing. Um, but yeah, welcome well. to okay. the miniverse. Ah, we're on, are we? Uh, we are on and rolling and whatever other synonym you have for recording. Uh, what, 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 what's rolling. up? What's up, guys? You can't see us, but we can see you. Yeah, this is How the first time in Anniversary History, yeah. uh, in rebooted Anniversary <laughs> so History, creepy. that you cannot see our faces. So which one of us is talking right now? I bet you don't know. That is so creepy. It's like, you cannot see us, but we can see you. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's the new Google <laughs> technology. They, uh... Uh, you you can see the people watching you. See what, yeah, what, what, what your your webcam is on right now, and yeah. uh, we're mm -hmm. looking through your webcam. See no no what, what's it like? You know that new Google Glass thing that they brought out? Yeah. That it actually helps people with Google Glass see people watching them over the internet. Yeah. Yeah, that's how it works. Yeah, so we're we're testing it for Google. Yeah, because we're we're partners and 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 Bill is sexy. Yeah, I'm not a partner, yeah, but Bill I'm hit sexy up, like, enough the, to the, where the I... CEO of Google. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just say what I cooked him dinner. Do? Let's just what say. What did you have to do for the CEO of Google to get that, to get this privilege? Let's, Let's just say I cooked him dinner. Let's just leave it at that. Okay. Was it a uh, sausage dinner dip. with a uh, creamy sauce? Uh, I will not share my recipes. <laughs> a gentleman doesn't <laughs> share his right. recipes. He doesn't cook and tell. <laughs> uh, I should say. Wink, wink. Wink, wink. Giggity, giggity, giggity. But yeah, what, where are we going with this? With this miniverse, <laughs> I figured I'll tell everyone what this is because they're probably, probably confused and yeah. uh, alone and cold, uh, listening to this. Now, uh, where there are no faces to be seen, uh, mm -hmm. we want to we want to fill you guys with content, with our content. Um, <laughs> yeah, we do on a on a weekly basis. But the way we <laughs> upload uh, and record the anniversary episodes live, we do that bi weekly. So we figured, hey, why not, why not record a little tiny snack-sized portion of the anniverse um, in between the main course? And and uh, surprisingly, we brilliantly came up with the name Miniverse. Um, yeah, that's that's that, genius. Yeah, I I don't know how we came up with that name. Uh, I'll tell it you, took us hours, but we did it. Uh, we hours did. and a lot of math uh, went into went into this. Like, you know how, like, when you're in high school and they say, oh, you never, ever do algebra in real, in, like, yeah. real life? Oh. Well, we did. We did. We did yeah, algebra. It was, it was mental. I haven't done that since high school. I had, I have, like, a, 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 like a, a board, a board, a does board, whatever. And uh, I just, I, it, it had so much. I had to use the other side. You know how, like, you can flip it? You know, it's one of those. <laughs> yeah. You can flip to the other side. I had to use both sides. Lots of both sides. Involved. I actually had to tweet uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson as well about it because i didn't understand this problem that we were having but he, he answered me back and we it was all good we private messaged we'll get him on the game any of us one day it'll be good i mean now i was i was in the game for anniverse dark of the moon or anniverse light um for for this but uh uh the miniverse was was picked um by but that that, that miniverse kind of takes out the anime part of our name as well but yeah, oh well. so that means we can talk about <laughs> everything like the surface area of my ass yeah, we still haven't even mentioned anime. That's exactly like yeah, we haven't the mentioned name. anime, but we have mentioned that there is indeed a a solution for the surface area of my butt. 
Um, it's a, isn't that um isn't that three point one five two six? <laughs> almost pi. Well, <laughs> almost pi. <quite. laughs> well, when you talk about that's what only comes out of it. Of my book, <laughs> I, I kind of like to <laughs> that's what comes out of it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh wow! But yeah, so we're here basically Welcome just to, the to, universe, guys. to do nothing but but just make you guys uncomfortable. Um, yeah, you guys can probably guess that we weren't prepared as usual. No, no, that's what no. we're talking about. Here's, Bill's here's, butt. A funny, here's a funny look um, right now at at what you just said about being prepared. Is that when we do the anniversary, we're not even prepared. Uh, yeah, we. Well, it's kind like, of prepared. We have a doc. We have, we have questions that I just copy and paste Game of Thrones links into. Uh, he does. <laughs> it was really hard looking through the dot for Doja, and I'm just like, okay. <laughs> he even wrote a whole story about himself. Yeah. Like, he wrote himself into Game of Thrones, like <laughs> like a paragraph. <laughs> I wonder how long it took you, man. Did you like? Did you like have to like edit edit some parts? You have to like, you know. When it was, I, it, was there a rough draft? You know, when I was done writing that, I was sweating. That's. <laughs> That. It got you that hate uh, the Kurokono basket character. Um, oh, that, that, there we go. That's oh wait, no, we're on the wrong podcast here. <laughs> this is a manga pod. What is this? <laughs> Was not prepared. Yeah, but we just we just decided right now because we we're like okay, um, we we have this awesome topic that Bill probably thought of, and then we got into the call and Bill didn't think of anything. No, he so had we just decided about this this record. topic. And well, let's talk about it. this. I just ate half a bag of chips. Um, oh man, too mm. really. Yeah, uh, and they were pretty good. Um, it was a different flavor, bag though. We didn't eat the same one. bag. They were barbecue. Ah, good choice. Oh, I got I got these like really spicy jalapeno ones. Oh, dude, I stay away from anything jalapeno. Well, here's, oh, I, I, I jalapeno. here's my relationship with jalapeno. I I love the taste of jalapeno. I love it, um, but I don't like what it does to me. Um, you mean the after effects? Yeah, yeah. It it's not <laughs> the coolest person to hang out with. But I I, 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 I when every time it says after effects, I just think of the editing program. And I'm like, that's exactly. Oh, why, why are we doing 3D text now? Said. I don't get this. Uh, that's what he, that's what like he, he thinks when he eats a jalapeno. Just jalapeno is composite. He's, he's a video it's editing program. Right. Bill was just like, I can I can I'm a video editing program that can do 3D text. I am amazing. Yeah, it, it composite. Um, and he hates it, and he hates that. He hates that. He thinks that. But yeah, jalapenos. I love jalapenos. Never. I don't think I've actually had jalapenos. I, I, I don't. I don't. I don't like to eat food that's pronounced with a H that's actually starting with a J. Jalapeno. 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 Yeah. Um. I just had jalapeno like a beef Japanese. jerky the other day. Um, really? It was just dried jalapeno. What? <laughs> that be that would just be a jerky. This was. <laughs> A jalapeno flavored beef jerky. Um, it had jalapeno uh, spice all over the meat, um, and it was good for five minutes. Uh, and then, and then the after effects. Yeah, <laughs> and then and the, the three D editing program came into effect, and he was like, "Oh yeah, got this on the toilet. Yeah, it's all good." Have you guys ever opened up? Um, I was eating, and now just just for random, I was eating. Do you ever have the like the little cracker sandwiches that, that have peanut butter in them? The orange crackers? I, I can't eat peanut butter. Are you allergic? Yeah. Let's just switch gears to that real quick. Um Daz is allergic to peanuts. Yeah. Um, which means he can't just go to the jar of peanut butter and eat a spoon of it. Um Well, see, I could, but then my I would be turned into a massive rash. My whole body would just be rash. Hey, man, freedom then... isn't free. So you know what? Go <clears throat> risk it. Eat a spoonful of peanut butter. And, you know. No, I, I kind of do want to be here. I don't want this to be a post-mortem. <laughs> <laughs> but the first. thing is, like, <laughs> is that, would that be worth it? Would that be worth it? I don't know. Well, I mean, if anyone was wondering how he died, just come back and listen to Miniverse Episode 1, and I effectively killed him. But... By forcing him you, to get, you put you put the seed into his head into his mind. And I bet I did. <laughs> you planted the seed. What what I will do is go into my cupboard and get a whole 
the, the jar of Vegemite that we have and just do a spoonful of that. What is in Vegemite? I don't know what's in Vegemite. I think it's mostly salt. <laughs> Let's let, let's Google know, what's in Vegemite. I know that it's I know that it's a really unattractive dark color. Um, Not that bad. It just looks like shit on the um <laughs> on the bread. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's, 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 it just looks like shit. It's okay. <laughs> it does. It's not too bad when it's in the jar. I'm gonna admit it just looks like it's brown black mush. <laughs> all right, uh, Vegemite. Spread it all over. It, the common method of eating Vegemite is on toasted bread with one layer of butter or margarine before spreading a thin layer of Vegemite. Eh. Um, uh, Vegemite is one of the world's richest known sources of vitamin D, B, sorry, specifically th- thiamine, robiflamin, ni- ni- niacin, and folic acid. Uh, main ingredient is yeast extract. With high concentration of glutamic acid, it does not contain any fat, added sugar, or animal content. It would suck if you were like allergic to gluten at all. I, 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 I hear the gluten word thrown around a lot nowadays, mm. and I don't know what it is. It's something. <laughs> There you have it, everybody. I don't know why we're talking about this crap when we could be talking about Nutella. I, I don't like Nutella, so. Oh. I once had I once had a Renaissance Fair. Oh, uh, it has it has nuts in there, right? You can't have that. Exactly. Um, uh, I, I went. How to, do you live? Yeah. Well, how, <laughs> very very easily by not eating food that will kill me. Oh, this man, is you're missing out. Yo, you know what's too. really weird? Speaking of being allergic to foods, um, I am allergic to now. I'm self diagnosed Diagnosed. Um, so, aka, he's not allergic to. So aka, I don't know what exactly is going on when I eat these things, but I think I'm allergic to them. Um, select fruits. Um, <laughs> I'm allergic to. It's so weird because, like, like the best fruits I'm allergic to. Uh, what happens is my mouth gets really itchy, and so does my throat. Um, but I never, I never used to be allergic to these fruits. I used to eat these things like a monster. I'm allergic to watermelon. Which man, I used to every summer I used yeah, to shove my black, face man. in a watermelon, um, but I can't eat it anymore. Or I my throat gets itchy and I puke. Uh, I can't eat oranges, same results. Bananas, same results. Um, I don't know what are the fruits because I can eat apples, pears, grapes. Uh, but yeah, what the hell, man? Uh, over the summer I got a banana smoothie and I forgot I was allergic to bananas. Oh damn. <laughs> and uh, I was on the boardwalk, and I, I took that, ruined, one that ruined your whole summer. I took a sip of it, and I was like, "Oh no!" And uh, but I, but I, I felt bad. You know, I wasn't gonna hand it back because I really. Um, so you just ate it and died. Yeah, I threw it in the garbage. Um, oh. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I haven't found a food that I'm allergic to. Yet. You're lucky. And I've eaten a lot of food. So, I've eaten a lot of food. Yeah. But how does it feel to be allergic to it? Describe describe your your feeling of like puffing up. Who are we talking? talking to Dazza right now? Anybody? I, I don't I don't puff up. I rash, and it gets itchy as balls. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever had itchy balls? Yeah, so your whole body and they just feels don't like go it's away. Balls. It's like that all over your body. <laughs> His body becomes just itchy balls. That's all it is. Not like sweaty itchy balls. It's just itchy. <laughs> oh man! I'm gonna take yeah, this I'm conversation. I'm, I'm gonna take it somewhere else. Um, okay. uh, uh, you, you didn't have anything, did you? I don't know where to take it. <laughs> Everything. That, the only thing on his mind right now is just sweaty itchy balls. <laughs> you can't think of anything. This is like playing hot potato and just holding onto the potato after you grab. I don't know what to do with this. I don't know where to take it. Um, it burns. It burns. <laughs> this conversation about itchy balls burns. <laughs> um, uh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was going to talk about the peanut butter in these cracker sandwiches. Um, yes. But it's not very interesting. This is how desperate I am for a topic. Um, <laughs> all I was going to say is that when you open up the cracker sandwich, the peanut butter, it, it looks like 
uh, watercolor paint. Um, uh, so, yep. How you so, guys? That's it? I, Is that what we got? <laughs> I like that. It's just like, okay, it's just like paint. That was what I was going to say. That is fascinating. I shaved my face today. Uh, oh, 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 that that there is something to commemorate in the... <laughs> now people will make fun of your, your beard. <laughs> yeah. Uh, here's the thing, though. Like, I look, I look different. Like, my beard wasn't big, that big. But in person, there was a beard there. Um, and I look like I just de-aged um, four years. And my no, face, I know exactly what you mean. When I'm clean shaved, I look like I'm 14. My face looks like... When I have a beard, I look like I'm oh, 30. Oh, I got, um, I got carded yesterday at the bank because I went to get a Visa debit card because PayPal are a massive pile of wank because um, you need a card for something. I went to the bank. I walked up to the tele the teller people and I'm just like, hey, I need a Visa debit card. Uh, how would I go about that? And they're like, are you 18? And I'm just like, yes. And she's like, are you sure you're over 18? And I'm just like, yes. Then she's like, uh, can I see your driver's license? <laughs> I'm just like, here. Now, mind you, I was in a business, like, casual business, like, suit thing. So unless I look like a four-year-old in a suit when I'm going to the bank. They which... thought you looked under 18. Yeah. Damn, dude. I don't even get carded at clubs. Like, I went to the club on the weekend, and I did not get carded for anything. Go to the bank. Oh, yeah. We've got a card. Yeah, it's, it's serious, serious uh, business like, here. What? What? That's have, pretty funny. I have a story. It's not about they being thought you were 14. It, but it's it's kind of a, a misperception uh, um, on me. That happened to me twice. Okay? Now, my hair used to be down to my shoulders. Um, and that's not an ideal haircut for me anymore. Um... But uh, it was down to my shoulders, and I was at a banquet. For my grandfather was retiring from something, and there was a banquet. And the waiters would come around and ask you what dish you were going to order. Um, so the waiter was behind me, um, and he was asking um, my cousin next to me what he was wanting, what he was wanting to get. So while the waiter was still behind me, he decided to ask me. Um, and he asked me in this way. He goes, excuse me, ma'am, what dish would you like? I turned around and I'm like, I want the beef in in manliest voice possible. And then that was it. End of that exchange. And then. So he, he saw you from the back, right? Yeah. And that was a woman. Um, <laughs> while I'm in a dress shirt and pants. Um, uh, unless I was just really, really. Uh, hey, I feel like I've heard this story before. I think I might have <laughs> yeah. told this. I don't know where I told this, but I might have told this. Um, the other time, I was working at Kmart um, in the sporting goods section, and this old guy came looking for a fishing license, and uh, he called me Miss. But he called me Miss from the front um, uh, with my name <laughs> on. Did you have, like, one of those beards like you usually have as well? No, I was clean shaven at this point, but he called okay, me Miss. Was... <laughs> what was your reaction, like, when he called you Miss? Um, I just kept printing out a fishing license dude um, i would have been like excuse me <laughs> i would have acted coy and flirted with him um but i didn't <laughs> he was flirted with him. um he got his <laughs> number no you gave him your number <laughs> i wrote it on his fishing license that's what happened <laughs> on the back call me <laughs> you have hey. a license to date me now sir let's let's go out Oh my goodness, man! Well, yeah. So I've been like, mistaken as a woman before, um, multiple times. Not even multiple once. Multiple times. <laughs> Disgusting. Maybe, I, maybe if I grew my hair back out again, I can get into clubs without, without a card. Because you know how it's always. Dude, you'll have you'll have guys buying you drinks. Yeah, that women can get in clubs because they're all hot. I'm just gonna grow my hair back out and just jump the line for really high profile clubs in New York City. And then when I get in there, just rip off whatever clothes I have. Wait a minute, I just worded that wrong. Um, <laughs> what, what I meant oh was take off my girl disguise. He's like, oh my god, Fuck. it's not a woman. <laughs> yeah. What a good disguise. Oh, dude. Yeah, that, that's never happened to me before. I've never been. Well, I, oh, I, I would hope not. 
that nobody has <laughs> taken you for a woman. Or you just mean in general, like being carded for something. Is that what you mean? No, I, I, I don't get... I don't know, but I, I don't get carded that much. Like, when I go to, like, a 7-Eleven or whatever, um, they never, never card me. What's a 7-Eleven? It's like a mini mart type thing. But why would you get caught at a Seven Eleven then? No, and and like at, at a Safeway, more like of a, it, it's a bigger, it's a bigger. Why store. why would you get caught at there though? That doesn't make sense. Oh, like I mean, like when when you're buying like alcohol or something. Oh yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. When you're buying um, a gulp with cherry flavor. Same thing when uh like yeah. go go to a bar. There it's it's most of the time you don't get carded. No. Uh, I don't know why that is. The only time I ever got carded. When I was when I was with my last girlfriend, and we were um getting alcohol, and they look at me and they're like, "How old is she?" And I'm just like, "Older than what I am." <laughs> and they had to look at her ID, and it was funny. That was the only time I've been. Yeah, but the thing is, I look like I'm her. thirty. So yeah, you look old, man. Yeah, you're an old fuck. Unless I like get a, if I get a haircut right now, to like short hair and like shave shave all my facial hair, I'm gonna look like I'm 14. I'm telling you. Do it and make a new. People YouTube are gonna channel? think I like and I quit and like gave my channel to yeah. a younger version. I was just gonna, gonna say I yeah. Give it to a younger brother. Do that and like become a whole new person and like fake your death. Boom, dude. Fake. And then like come the back five drama. years later. Joke drama, game talk drama. <laughs> yeah. Go yeah, fake your death. Shave your head and everything. Fake your death. Have like you know your fake like twin brother take it over who's younger than you. We can't. He can't be your twin then. Um, rewind that. Rewind <laughs> that. Twin uh, brother that's younger. Than rewind you. that shit. Uh, a little bit. Pretend you're like you know um, it's you, your fake cousin. Come back five years later as Yokorama. Um, but bring back Zero X Requiem at the same time. As yeah, Yokorama. Sasuke, how am I gonna get? How am I gonna hold that guy? No. He's back. I don't even know. He is? is he? Yeah. Who is he? Probably. Why are well, you explaining I mean, to our listeners who this guy is? Well, I mean, like, no. I mean, like, he's not like that. He isn't deserved. Well, actually, nobody even knows what Xerix Requiem is either. No. <laughs> no. These are references of YouTube. That, that, that can, whole like, story of yours, Bill, has so many inside inside jokes and inside stories that everybody's going to be sitting there like, what? I, I don't even get what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, and he's, he's, yeah, he's a part of this. <laughs> and he doesn't even know what's happening. Um, but yeah, um, anime. Um, I guess we're not talking about that. Oh, yeah, let's, we should, we let's should... talk about that. Let's talk about anime. Here on All the... right, so what are you guys watching today? What, <clears throat> what have you been watching in the last few days? Why don't we talk about that? I haven't watched anything. I, I haven't watched anything either. I, I've um, been watching Torador. That's about it. Actually, I lie. I lie. I lie. I watched Orishira episode 10. Orishira is a good show. <laughs> oh, Orishira is so good. Oh, such All a good right. harem. For I, Harem, that's a really good one. It's a really I, good. Yeah, I was really surprised that it was really good. But I noticed someone was tweeting at me saying they were reviewing it. And I'm just like, I might watch this show. Have a look at it. And then I watch it. I'm like, this is really good. I really like the art style as well. It's very um, see, it's very, <clears throat> it's very pastel. Like I'm, I'm very hesitant to watch that because I really genuinely can't stand Harem's. Um, they just yeah. This one get goes a little bit over the top with some of the harem. Moments. Yeah, some of it's a bit stupid. And like the the, the main character, he's, he's kind of like he's cool as well. How I made it through the Love Hina manga, I will never know. Love uh, Hina manga is great though. Come I, on, love, I, I, could, I, I love, I couldn't, but I couldn't make it through the Love Hina TV show. I don't understand. I uh, love Hina yeah. anime sucks. I couldn't watch any of that. Fuck. Doesn't exist. Uh, um, but yeah, if you wanna, you wanna, if you want the true Love Hina experience, read the manga. Fourteen volumes, very good, very good. I lie though. I, I um, I was gonna say this for Anniversary, but I missed. Um, I'll just watch another film. I watched Summer Wars. Um, have either of you seen that? I know Dazza has. What, what is Summer Wars? I've never heard of such. Just watch it. movie. I've heard. Of course, I've seen it, man. <laughs> Well, that's like asking. It's like asking us if we haven't seen, if we've never heard of One Piece. Kiss yeah, my ass. I, the thing is, I watched. I watched Summer Wars before it like got all big. Like it came out in America and stuff. I watched what? it like when it was just fan sub. All right. Was- no, no, Yokorama, Yokorama. I saw it in the cinema before it came out in Japanese DVD. Booyah! Did you? Well, you know yeah. what? I saw it last month. Ah, <laughs> uh, dude. 
You suck. <laughs> <laughs> I, th- I think Bill wins the hipster contest here. That means your your uh, opinion doesn't matter because no. you just saw. <laughs> Dude, there's like a whole other movie by him out. You should, I have to watch that now too. Yeah, what's that one called? Wait, which one? Wolf Children. Oh yeah, I've heard of that one. I haven't seen that yet. But anyway, Summer Wars was awesome. Yeah. Um, I. Why don't you Why don't you tell everyone what Summer Wars is about? I forget. Oh my god. <laughs> No, this is such a noob. This there's this I forget the name of the of the system. Um there's this whole internet system that exists that is very integral to the way a lot of people live and the way a lot of businesses operate. Oh, Oz, Oz, that's right. Um and um that's that's kind of just in place in the beginning. It doesn't doesn't really have any emphasis on what, what's going to happen. It's like the um the John the John Lennon and Yoko Ono reference. Yes, I did. Um, yes. I, it was so, it was so blatant. <laughs> <laughs> this is John and Yoko. Yeah, the two. Like it wasn't even like oh subtle. It was oh the two people who run Oz are named John and Yoko. No, no, no. They're, they're the um they're the AI security system whales that fly around Oz. Yeah. Oh, I just assumed yeah. they were the ones who, who. No, no, no. Oz is um. I don't. I don't know who who made Oz. I don't think I actually specifically say who made Oz. Well, I guess I know why the security failed because of Yoko Ono. Um, <laughs> uh, but no, yeah. What happens is this girl asks um, this boy to come with her to her grandmother's house. Yeah. Um, why? I forget why. To pretend to be her boyfriend so she can impress yes. her grandmother. Um, and yeah, it's called coming back to me now. Uh, <laughs> and. Um, while they're there, um, the main character is really good at math, and he gets a text message with this math question that this mysterious anonymous person asked him to solve, and he solves it because he's a rad motherfucker. And um, this guy uses that solution to hack the world of Oz. And the problem is that Oz powers and governs a lot of really important things in the world, um, and it and it creates an issue for her grandmother um i think <laughs> yeah. that is spoiling I, think, uh, I think one of my favorite things was um the president's account has been hacked i'm just like why would the president have an account on the internet <laughs> and then it, they and not to spoil it, i mean i assume everyone's seen the film it's 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 one of those films that everyone should have seen already i saw it last month <laughs> yeah if you haven't seen the film just well, you're skip, a bill dude you're just bill. skip skip That's over right. a bit in, in, in um, two years, that's when it came out. The president's account gets hacked. Uh, so nukes, missile nukes are sent. I'm just like, what? Why would the president's account be linked to the missiles in America? Oh, it's, it's, it's like... It's funny it's and fa- ridiculous. I loved... The soundtrack was incredible. Yeah. Um, Yes. And I loved the giant ice cubes. Um, the giant ice cubes were that's, amazing. That's a weird thing to love about it, but I, I love them. <laughs> I like the giant boat that comes from the sky. Yeah. This is a great, this is a great uplifting movie. Um, it is. It's really fun. For everyone. And it's animated really well. It's beautiful. It's done by the uh, same director. that It's Mamoru Hosoda, who's the same director for... The first two, the first two parts of the Digimon film. Yeah, they're amazing. And the girl who left through time, I as must. well as he did. I think he did two or three episodes of Yu Hakusho as well. Yeah. If I recall correctly, I knew Yokoran would like that. But he's an amazing director. I actually, I could, I could tell which episodes. Um, yeah, you could, you can actually tell. Like he's got a very distinct. Style. Yeah, he has, he has his like, like style. Like um, really. I was watching through the classic Digimon series. And he directed two episodes of that. I think it was a Hiei fight. And he, um, you could really tell which ones were his episodes. And I'm just like, and then I looked it up afterwards. I'm just like, which ones are his? Ah, uh, yeah, that's, that's his episodes. Yep, that was cool. So I was like, yeah. <laughs> I'm a very Mamoru Hosoda fan because he's really good. I reckon he's the next Miyazaki, but that's just mine. Yeah, Girl, girl That Left Through Time or whatever. That's a really good movie. I didn't see that. That's a- um... Yes, it is. I just I just saw okay. it like a year ago, <clears throat> and that was amazing. Someone spoiled it on me, and watch I was just like, oh, okay. Watch it. I really think 
you guys should watch that. I think you guys should watch um, uh, what's it called as well? Uh, Wolf Children. Yeah, that's, that, that's one of my like out in but... subtitles and whatever else I need to watch it. I uh, yes. It's out in Japan on Blu-ray and DVD, is what I'm going to say. Well, then, yes, I will watch it. Come back at um, Wolf, uh, come back at Wolf Children and tell us what you thought of it. I will come back I will on Anniverse and tell us what you thought. I'll watch it for Anniverse. Yeah, do that. You, dude, you're probably not going to do it. No, you won't. Hey! <laughs> hey, well, I, I was going to we got, like We got no faith in you, man. <laughs> you. I, I said this to Daza, um... Uh, because I'm so bad at finishing shows, um, for every anniversary episode, I will have watched one or two anime films so that you know I could watch them in one sitting, and then I have something to talk about. So I started with Summer oh, Wars. Nice. Got to bring be, it up. That'll be very good. That'll be very good. I, I forgot to bring it up last episode because I'm an asshole. Um, but I, I had Kuroko to talk about, and at the time, I wasn't watching that yet. So when I watched Summer Wars, so that's okay. It'll work. I finish it by next episode, right? By, I want to. By next yeah. episode? I want to. Yeah, yeah, that's my. What? Plan. Where are you at, Akira? Now, like, what episode? Only on, just to like uh, update. Seven, so I didn't make any progress since last anniversary, but I, I oh. didn't really. I wasn't really home over the weekend, so I couldn't really. But now that I'm back in school, I'm ground. I'm like not grounded, but I'm kind of just kind of stuck here now. I can't really do anything, so I will be watching it again as as game as well as Game of Thrones. So. Uh, ah, can't wait for that. But wait, yeah. Wanna... Um, Let's wrap this up. This was the Miniverse episode one. It was very bad. Um, <laughs> I don't think we talked anything other than Bill's butt and we talked about butt balls, yeah. allergies, and being mistaken as a mainly different, uh, different like bread spreads. We talked about that as well. Bread, bread spreads. Yeah. Yes, bread yeah. spreads. And a little bit about anime. A little, a little bit at the. At the right, right at the end. <laughs> yes, that could be the common theme. We talk about butts, bread spreads, and allergies, and then at the end of every miniverse, we'll talk. Finish about. off with a movie that Bill has been watching. Movie that <laughs> Bill will never watch. Um, um, why, why, why don't you email us some topic questions? Yes. Yeah, and, specifically for the miniverse, right? Yeah, yeah specifically universe. say it's for the miniverse. And don't be like, hey, have you guys seen this series? Because we won't answer yes. that. For the miniverse, you can ask us anything you want. So any question yeah, it doesn't have to be just us, about anime. That's that's a cool yeah. thing about miniverse. Any question that you want to ask us that you thought, oh, I can't, I want to know what, what Bill's favorite color sock is. Um, what color is it, Bill? It's white. But you couldn't ask that for the anniversary because... Actually, I prefer black socks. Really. Black socks? Yeah, I'm a yep. black sock person. I was well. once told by someone um, that I went to high school with that if I wear white socks, then I'm a fucking asshole. These are his exact words. Um, Bill? Bill? You don't need to wear white socks to be a fucking asshole. You are a fucking <laughs> asshole. Yeah, you're probably not even wearing socks right now in your fucking ass. He, he, he was just telling you. He was just trying to be a bit more subtle about yeah, I mean, it. I just I grew up on he white. Was trying socks. to connect it to something to be more nice, but <laughs> I I grew up on white socks. I just I know white socks. You know, like I'm familiar with them. I'm comfortable with white socks. If I were to put black socks on my feet, I wouldn't feel like I'm the same man. Um, Actually, the thing is, like Russian culture, nobody wears white socks. Oh, is this is this is this an actual like thing? Yeah. If, well, I I don't know any Russian that wears white socks. It's um, it's I don't know. it's uncommunist so this, to wear white socks. So this is like you're just assuming this. It's a thing. It's a thing. It's, it's a, a whole thing. like country thing. It's a culture thing. Black it's socks. Like how Australians uh, use uh, kangaroo. But yeah, that's this is <laughs> yeah. episode one. Network anniversary at gmail dot com. Email us your questions yeah. about yeah. Universe Network or the anniversary. Anniversary. You guys better send us something. And if the question for the miniverse, put it in the subject line. Um, miniverse colon what are Bill's favorite color boxers? Um, what what oh, color I are they, Bill? Right now. Uh, right now I'm wearing I'm wearing gray boxers. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I'm not wearing any boxers. Um, um, oh, you can also tweet at us at uh, Anniverse Network. Anniverse. And there's also 
uh, what, what the Facebook page, which is the Universe Podcast. All of this will be and in the description. Gamos as well. There's, you can, you get, there's like 10 ways you can reach us. Probably not 10, but there's a lot yeah. of ways you can reach us. If you want, we'll reach us. You can even comment on this video. That's a novel like, idea. Actually, yes, uh, you can call, that works too. Remember, you can text message Bill uh, 24-7. Or you can well. come to my house. I want you guys here. Um, he'll he'll pour you a glass of pink lemonade. And yep. he'll pay your transport costs as well. Yep, I am rolling in so much money um, that I will not only pay for your transport costs, but I will take you out for dinner every single night you're here. To you win. can never leave. If you, if you go there, you, you'll love it so much that you'll never leave. Mm. Yeah. Join my family. <laughs> so yeah, that's episode one of the Miniverse. Welcome to the Miniverse, everybody. <laughs> this is episode one. Um, yeah, guys. Hopefully, hopefully there there's some kind of enjoyment from, the, from this this episode. Uh, something to listen to in the background while um you're doing better yeah. things. <laughs> yeah, while you're editing, while you're pooping or whatever, eating a hoagie. I, I always listen after, to the Universe while I'm effects. pooping. I I would hope that yeah. someone that 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 like that, like that connection's made. Like when okay, oh, I have to poop. Like the, the the poop word triggers universe, like miniverse, <laughs> like miniverse. Poop triggers miniverse, like oh, like, miniverse. I gotta tweet that out. Between, between they're entertainers, miniverse. They're directly associated. That should be that's our tagline for the miniverse. miniverse. No, no, that should be our like uh, subtitle. It should be like miniverse episode one. Poop triggers universe, <laughs> miniverse. Directly, it's like a or psychological just Pavlovian conditioning. You think poop, you think universe, miniverse, every verse. Your yeah, but we're just around from a yeah. little we're, we're, we're gonna stop here i think i think that's a good idea right. thank you guys for watching uh, remember email us uh network anniversary gmail.com yep twitter us at anniverse network yep and uh facebook us at just the anniverse and yep. uh i'm yokurama i am moses or okay. mo you can call me mo because everybody's gonna start calling me mo, mo! Right, so, okay. <laughs> dude Shut up, princess. Moist towelettes. <laughs> Moistly. Moist, <laughs> Moist towelettes. Moist towelettes. <laughs> I think I think uh, Dazza called me that once. I did, I, I did. I think I did. I think I was in an anti like an anniverse pre. It was. It was one of our like uh, like verse. lost episodes or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Those original ones. <laughs> but yeah, I am Mo. I'm Mo or Yokurama or Moses or Mosey or whatever you want to call me. Moistly. Who else is here? Um, and I'm. Lead up with Azza. I'm Bill. Uh, yeah. You're so late, Bill. Seriously. Well, you know, better late than never. Um, that's for sure. That's what I've always said. You know, I've grown up um, with that mentality. Uh, better late than right, never. Don't go into another tangent. Yeah, it's it's over. It's no. over, Bill. It's <laughs> over. <laughs> I watch anime the way that I do. Um, you know, I'm, I'm late to watching Summer Wars, but at least just, I watch... Just... Just and you're still recording. Seriously, I watch Broken Basket. Everyone's already talked stop, about it. Stop, um, stop, watching stop. This it. is why we shouldn't let Bill record because he never be, stops. Never. I don't. Think, I don't even uh, know if he stopped. And uh, still you know, I haven't seen Dark Knight Rises yet, but I'm sure I'm better late than never. Oh my goodness, really? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna end this now. <laughs>